James McCorkin, big win, big performance for our lads on Tuesday. How, how did you see the game? Uh, yeah, it was just a good game, good performance all round, and uh, we all had to work very hard against a good York team. Um, the game was quite open first half, but we felt we had the better of the play and deserved to win the game in the end. Was it as much about the result and performance, also about getting back a bit of momentum as well at this time of the season? Yeah, I think momentum's always important at this stage of the season, so we definitely want to get a bit of that back. But um, no, I thought we deserved it, and um, it's, it's good to see the lads, you know, really playing with confidence again. And from the, the lads' point of view, frustrated obviously with the three defeats and the manner of them in the sense that we could have taken something from from most of the game. So you're happy that that's sort of out of the way now, if you like, and out of mind. Yeah, I mean, the, you always get slumps in 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 every team, to be honest. And it's it's not plain sailing the whole season. So it's just about how you come out of that and how quickly you can turn things around and get back on track. And I feel like that's what we've done there. And with a view to the weekend, I guess after a big performance and a result like that, the important thing is, is to follow it up, but it won't be easy, will it? Yeah, we know going there will be tough once again, like every game's tough in this league. But uh, you know, we look forward to the game, look forward to the challenge, and we'll be ready to go. Played a lot of games against them in, in recent seasons, usually a, a good surface there. What, what are you expecting from them? Uh, yeah, I mean, it'd be nice to play on a good surface again. It, it, the pitch is normally decent there, so we look forward to going there. And we expect another physical game as with most teams in this league, and, and we'll be ready for it. Games against them usually involve uh, goals. They've scored a lot of goals themselves this season, so chances of a nil-nil are slim, but should be entertaining, to say the least. Well, yeah, but of course we'll be trying to go there and keep a clean sheet, and then if we can nick a goal, then we'll be delighted and, and try and get the three points. What about yourself? You, you've had to manage your, t your game time, I guess, over the last few weeks. How are you feeling? Uh, good, yeah, getting back to where I want to be, and you know, managed to... Uh, Get through a little, a little uh, niggle that I had, but now I'm feeling, feeling fresh and ready to go again. And in fairness, when you start sort of 25, 30 games almost in a row as you have done, it, it's almost natural to get a, a little bit here and there, in there in terms of wear and tear. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you always pick up little knocks, and that is just part of the nature of the game. And you know, if you can get through it, you get through it. And, and man, luckily, I've managed to do so. And it's important for the boys, I guess, to have as many fit and, and bodies raring to go at this time of the season, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, everybody's chomping at the bit to play. I mean, even the lads who aren't fit at the moment are, are desperate to get back in because, you know, we enjoy playing playing as a team and, and progressing in the league. And there's a clear uh, sign that the lads, whether it's playing from the off or whether they're getting 10 minutes off the bench at the end, everyone wants to do their bit, don't they? Yeah, well, the manager always says, you know, for the subs, and they'll always be ready to make a difference. And more often than not, they definitely make a difference when we need some fresh legs to come and see the game out or come and nick us a goal at the end and, and to win the game. I, I guess the lads in the management will, I know, in fact, don't spend a lot of time looking at the league table and, and where we might end up and what permutations. Is it just a case of going out and winning as many of what's left as possible? Uh, well, like they always say, it's like one game at a time, and, and it's you don't want to get bogged down by looking at the league too much, but... You know, we just go into every game thinking to be competitive and and to possibly go and win the game. And generally, if you do win just as many as you can, it tends to take care of itself, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, if if we're playing well, we know we know we can uh, get the results required to uh, get where we need to be.